up y'all B Dub the Anime Master is back for anime DVD reviews where I show you my anime collection talk a little bit about the show and uh, show you the DVD packaging so anyway today's review is Roni Kenshin very critically acclaimed anime series I tell you that I mean I, I and I put the emphasis on the fucking cuz it's fucking amazing but anyway Yes, Roni Kenshin, great shonen anime series. You know what I'm saying? This definitely, probably, maybe number number four in my top ten anime series. So, yes, Roni Kenshin box set. Well, this this contains the first season, and this contains the awesome, awesome, groundbreaking second season of Roni Kenshin. Now, a little backstory, a little you know synopsis on Roni Kenshin. Roni Kenshin stars a samurai warrior named Ken, um, Himura Kenshin, and he was a legendary manslayer back in the uh, what they call it, the Meiji days. No, no, it's the Meiji era uh, concurrently in the show. But I haven't watched the show in a while, so don't you know scold me for like getting some things messed up. But uh, yeah, uh, Himura Kenshin, uh, he's a legendary Batosai, the manslayer. And he used to, you know, slay people and shit and, and wars and shit. So he decided to give up that identity and become a wanderer or a wandering samurai. So um, throughout his journey of becoming a wandering samurai, he runs into uh, a bratty ass kid named Mahiko, a, uh, a very uh, monotone uh, martial artist swordsman named, uh, what's, his, what's his name? Sanosuke uh, Sagara. And he has a big dumbass sword and. Um, Let's see who else. Uh, the female's name is Kairu. You know what I'm saying? She's all. See, one thing about Ka Kairu's character is that she she makes Kenshin a little bit sometimes when she be like, no, you know, don't don't turn into the manslayer. That shit kind of pisses me off a little bit. But it, it's decent character development. But you know, she gets on my nerves. But but uh, yeah, in the first season, just goes through. You know. You know, different fights, different battles, you know, between those characters and, you know, leading up to the awesome Kyoto arc and the second season of Roni Kenshin. This arc is totally fucking badass, I'm telling you. As an anime fan, it is one of the best written anime story arcs I ever watched. Seriously. I mean, this story arc is amazing. And the English dub done by Media Blasters... It's fucking amazing. Don't look at that uh, that Sony Animax dub. You know what I'm saying? That dub fucking sucks. Even though some of the actors, you know, like Kenshin's actor, you know, is on that dub as well. But the, everybody else fucking sucks. So I advise you to go pick up the Media Blasters uh, Anime Works uh, dub of Veronica Kenshin. You know what I'm saying? But uh, here's the box of the first season. A red box. It isn't a, you know, box of brick. It contains six discs. You know, here's all the discs, first four discs, and the last discs. Now, one thing I don't like about Media Blasters, anime works, you know, is that some of their boxes are pretty shitty. And when I bought this, it came, my disc was all loose and, you know, shit like that, and I had to put them in these sleeves. This second season contains eight discs, you know what I'm saying? So, luckily, only the first disc was scratched up. You know what I'm saying? But I fixed it and I'll be replacing that this soon just in case it decides to stop working. But uh, yeah, Roni Kenshin. You know what I'm saying? This, this series is great. Go check it out if you're an anime fan of like samurai anime and swords and stuff like that. And, and you know, Japanese history, you know, Meiji era shit and all the government shit, all that shit. Seki Hotai, all that shit, you know? Check this series out Roni Kenshin seasons one and season two, which all together will be 62 episodes. So 27 episodes on this set and 35 episodes on this set. Uh, as for season, season three is a filler saga. And uh, in my old, 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 old anime collection video, uh, I said that it sucked and it, it does pretty much suck. But if you want more Roni Kenshin, you can go ahead and pick up the season three box set. I advise you not to, but you know, that's my opinion. But anyway, that was my DVD review of Roni Kenshin. Go check it out. I give Kenshin a fucking nine. You know, this anime is great. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, most of my reviews will probably, you know, have high high, high uh, scores, you know, because I only review anime that I like. I might start reviewing anime that I despise, but 
Probably not, you know what I'm saying? So, because I only buy anime that I like, you know, and hell, if I don't, I don't buy shit. If I do buy some bullshit, I will talk about it though. Like Street Fighter 4, the tires at that bind. That was a piece of shit. But anyway, I'm B Dub the Anime Master, and that was Anime DVD Reviews. Check them out. Peace.